Hi, I'm Russ. I'm 43 years old. I'm from Chicago, and I'm a passive income addict. <laughs> That's right. I'm addicted to dividends and addicted to that passive income, that sweet, sweet, sweet passive income. That's what we're going after here on the channel because we are working to make work optional, and we are doing that through stock and crypto, a passive income. So I don't have enough monthly dividend stocks in my life, and I really do need more because what I love about the monthlies is that you're receiving 12 payments a year as opposed to four, so you're compounding that much quicker. And secondly, you are also able to dollar cost average in more effectively because you're dollar cost averaging in 12 times a year instead of just four. And when you're dollar cost averaging in those four times, once every three months, if the stock is high, you're buying it at a higher price. So it's been a minute since I've been out to the Great White North. About four years ago, we took a 15-passenger van, two families, grandma and grandpa, all squeezed in there. I drove the whole way up to uh, Niagara Falls on the Canadian side. Fun trip, saw Toronto, we saw London, Ontario, home of the London Knights hockey team. And we just had a great time. Nothing bad to say about Canada, except I couldn't get over the $1 and $2 coins, which they have so lovingly named the Looney and the Toonie. You get it? Toonie, because it's a $2 coin, the Toonie. Ticker SJR Shaw. Check that out. Internet and mobile from $80 a month. If you're from Canada, let us know what you think of Shaw Communications. I'll link to this article that ranked the Canadian telecom companies and number four, Shaw Communications. They are a major telecom company paying that monthly dividend. And Shaw was founded in 1966 and is one of the oldest Canadian telecom companies. According to Seeky and Alpha, their current dividend yield is 3.7%, which is very nice seeing that north of three, paying out 92 cents per share per year. 81% payout ratio, a little bit high. Five-year growth rate of 0.42%, so that's a little bit low. And a one-year dividend growth streak. And if you're not familiar with the Simply Wall Street fair valuation, what they're using is a discounted cash flow model like Mr. Warren Buffett. They're looking 10 years into the future and discounting that back to a price today, which they give Shaw Communications a fair value of $38.57 making them about 22.88% undervalued from the current price of $29.77. So just yesterday, I worked in the other great white north for us Chicagoans up there in Wisconsin, as we lovingly call you people up there, Wisconsin. I worked in Janesville, Wisconsin, and while I was up there, I saw a sign. It was a big blue a big blue sign that had a white horse on it, and that white horse's name is Stag. Check out the picture where this truck is pulled up, this 53-foot trailer. This is what Papa works on. I install all this dock equipment, everything that a truck backs up into, the truck restraints, the dock seals and shelters, the doors, the mechanical and hydraulic dock levelers, all of that we work on, we take care of all of that, and that's what I've been doing for 22 years almost now. Stag Industrial, of course, is a REIT, which means they have to pay out 90% of their profit as a dividend. And check that out, they have 494 buildings in 39 states, totaling 99.1 million square footage. And I wanted to point out here in the Chicago market, some of the companies that they do have, Samsung and Target, and in the Philadelphia market, check out some of their recent tenants, Amazon, UPS, Kellogg's, Tesla, FedEx, Starbucks, some really big companies that are working with Stag and especially Amazon because we know Amazon is just going to keep growing, but they need more warehouse space. And that's where Stag comes in. According to Seeking Alpha, they have a 3.75% dividend yield, paying out $1.45 annually with a 72% payout ratio, five-year growth rate of only 0.89%, and they have been growing that dividend for two years. Simply, Wall Street has a fair value of $82.90, making Stag Industrial about 53.4% undervalued from their current price of $38.66. Next week, I will be buying some Stag Book It, 
I need this company in my portfolio. I need stag in my life. And I'm gonna be doing this inside of our Roth or our self-directed IRA because REIT dividends are non-qualified dividends, meaning that you will be paying your ordinary income tax rate on those dividends. So if you can hold REITs inside of a tax deferred uh, brokerage account, such as a 401k or a Roth or an IRA, then that is ideal because you are not going to be paying that extra tax on those dividends. And especially with the monthlies, you are going to save a little bit of money. Now, when I was a little Cheerins, my grandfather used to take me to Walgreens with him. And it was something I loved doing, just him and I, the two men riding to Walgreens to get whatever we needed, odds and ends. And I'll never forget the one time we walked down the tobacco aisle and he picked up the big bag of pipe tobacco and smelled it and said, I'll tell you what, boy, I could just start smoking again like that. And he said, don't ever start smoking. So naturally, being the curious kid I was, I got his old pipe and some old tobacco and went behind the garage where I was smoking his pipe and he caught me red-handed made me finish smoking the entire pipe as a punishment, and that's the day I began smoking pipes. <laughs> I'm just kidding, I don't smoke. I had asthma as a kid, and smoking is really bad for you. And Walgreens is one of the top tenants of Realty Income, ticker O. They are the monthly dividend company. That's their headline, that's their moniker, that's what they want to be and what they are known as. They've had 610 consecutive monthly dividends paid, which is over 50 years, 110 dividend increases and 94 consecutive quarterly increases with a dividend growth of 213.3%. Check out those dividend increases from 1994. That is just filthy. Look at that filthy realty income. And they've paid over $7.8 billion in dividends over 52 years. And you gotta love this comparison table, 4.4% blowing away everything else out there. The averages love realty income. One of my favorite dividend companies and my favorite monthly dividend paying company. Seeking Alpha has a current dividend yield of 3.97%, paying out $2.82 annually. Keep in mind, they do pay that every 12 months, but they have been increasing it every quarter. They pay out ratio 83%. Remember, they're a REIT. Five-year growth rate, 3.86%. That is solid. And growing that dividend for 24 years, this is why they're number one. Simply Wall Street has a fair value of $119.70, making realty income about 41.2% undervalued from their current price of $70.38. Realty Income, Stag Industrial, and Shaw Communications, three super solid and tip-top shape monthly paying dividend companies. What are your favorite monthly paying dividend companies? I'd really like to know, so leave your comment below. And if you didn't know, Realty Income is about to get even stronger, so check out this video I did on their proposed merger with Verit, and I will talk to you there.